The Grand Mafrosian versus Albert Morales for the Spar Star MMA 145 pound title. This is Jonathan King from theclinchreport.com. With me, my co host, Matthew Spencer, Spar Star 185 pound champ. Matthew, we got ourselves in the middle of the main event. Oh, yeah. This is the fun part right here. I've been to the few these myself. They're throwing leather already. Matarosian comes out with heavy hands, lands a left and right, but boy, does he get caught. Morales That's caught him with a left. Setting up the triangle. Transitions arm to the arm bar. Not Morales in good position, now closes the guard. Matatrosian able to escape an early submission attempt, but he's not out of trouble at all. Oh, nice sweep. Beautiful positioning. Morales has him in trouble. Spins around in the side control. Matrosian put a good effort in, now he got him back into the guard but still a bad position. Alternating between the body and the head, Morales in dominant form right now. Matrosian eating some serious ground and pound. Herb watching this one close. Oh, nice sweep Nice sweep by, by Matrosian. Now Matrosian on top. Morales using the butterfly guard to push him back. Matrosian wants this fight on the, on the feet as he lets him stand. Both fighters in the center of the cage. Nice head kick. Switch kick from Marisrosian. Nice spinning oh, roundhouse gets caught. Runners. Looks like he didn't have the distance to throw that kick. No. Now Morales. Morales in the crucifix position. Crucifix you watch position. Out. He almost threw an elbow there. That would have got him DQ'd. Nice in the north-south position. Very astute observation. Elbows are illegal in the amateur ranks on the ground. Oh, nice pound. Mastrosian looking for the ankle pick to try to throw the switch. Hammer fist for Morales. But Morales is all over him. And that's the story for the first round. Albert Morales, dominant position. The more aggressive fighter. And once again, we go back to the old cliche that the story in the corner tells the tale between rounds. Right now, they're telling Morales to keep it on the ground. It's a clear dis disadvantage for Trojan to be on the ground with this guy. Trojan's looking for the highlight rail kicks, but they're getting him set up for an easy takedown. Yeah, it, it looks like Maris Trojan's trying to end the fight with one shot. Uh, he's obviously got um, Morales' jujitsu on his mind. Uh, he's He's not committing to his strikes. He's throwing them one at a time. And, and every time Morales is able to get a hold of him, the fight goes to the ground with very little opposition. Yeah, he better get his game face going. I've been in a couple of these main events for titles, and what you don't want to do is lose the first round. We are all set for round two. Veteran referee Herb Dean calls the fighters to the center, awesome and we are underway. That. You have heard of Dean calling the title fight. How great is that? Both fighters start off throwing big, heavy hands. Morales looking to establish the jab. Ducks under. Unable to get the takedown as Matasrosian sprawls away and delivers a knee. Now Morales being pressed back against the cage. Oh, nice, take down. Nice, nice takedown by Matasrosian, who's in top position. Side control. But Morales right back to guard, using that knee slide through. No, he has that triangle. Triangle it's deep. looks it's tight. Deep. It's deep. Beautiful it's transition. Oh. Mounted triangle. He's just got to get his head. That's oh! oh! Mounted triangle. Way to come back. Albert Morales with a mounted triangle submission. How about that for winning a world title fight? Winning the title for his systems training center partners who are all with a heavy heart this weekend after losing their teammate, D. Boyce. Albert Morales wins one for the team. How about that fight? That was a beautiful display of jiu-jitsu today. That was awesome, the way he just transitioned right into it after the takedown. He got the sweep and set it up, locked it in, mounted him, and it was all over. Once again, Matthew Spencer, Sparstar MMA 185-pound champion. Thank you for joining us. 
Where can we catch you next, Matthew? Uh, we're looking to see if we can get on King of the Cage this June, making my pro debut sometime this year. Absolutely. So I'll keep everyone posted. Excellent. Well, it's been a pleasure, Matthew. My Thank pleasure. you very much. Make sure you follow Sparstar MMA on Instagram and Sparstar Fights on Twitter. Check out JT Media, theclinchreport.com, Titan Body Wash, Fight Me Clothing, and Sniper Clothing. All right, fight fans, at 48 seconds of round number two, the referee stops the contest due to a tap out from a triangle choke. Our winner, he is the Star Star MMA featherweight champion, Albert the Warrior. Eskimo the way I let him go.